In Peru, President Pedro Castillo is facing a second impeachment vote in Congress, which could see the former teacher ousted just eight months after taking office. Dan Collins reports from Lima. The political crisis in Peru did not start with President Castillo, and it will likely not end if he is impeached. But that is what the former teacher from a peasant family now faces after narrowly winning the election last year. Lawmakers in the single chamber legislature are debating Castillo's fate, ahead of a vote which could happen after midnight. Before the debate began, Castillo addressed Congress. In the motion, in the motion being debated here, there is only hearsay, without any corroboration. It's all speculation and imagined links, unsupported both factually and legally. Congress voted to begin impeachment proceedings against the president earlier this month over corruption allegations. Castillo denies the allegations and blames them on economic groups seeking a, quote, coup against his government. Despite low approval ratings, Political analysts say the vote could favour Castillo, with his opponents falling short of the two-thirds majority in the chamber to oust him. However, Castillo is facing increasing pressure as prosecutors on Monday raided the homes of former officials and relatives for alleged graft. Dan Collins, CGTN, Lima.